Two old guys walking down the sidewalk. They come upon this frog. Frog says, hey fellas, if you pick me up and kiss me, I'll turn into a princess, live with you for the rest of your life. The old guy picks up the frog, sticks it in his pocket. The other old guy says, didn't you hear? He said, if you kissed her, she turned into a princess, live with you for the rest of your life. He said, at my age, I'd rather have a talking frog. <laughs> And you would, wouldn't you? I would. The princess is going to talk anyway. <laughs> hey, too, you'd, you'd, have, you'd have the princess for six weeks. You say to your friend, should I get the princess? They go, no, I'll just stay friends with <laughs> Two years later, you say, should I get the frog? They go, yeah, get the frog. Get the frog. <laughs> some of you haven't even cracked a smile tonight. Have you smoked some dope? <laughs> You know when you smoke dope, you can look down on a comedian. You know, you're like, oh yeah, that's funny. <laughs> that's interesting as well. Mm. I'm enjoying this. Mm. One time I, I did some LSD when I was 16, and we went out, we met some people who were stoned on grass, and we could look down on their high. Same, you know, I was like, oh yeah, I'd find that funny if I only smoked a little marijuana myself. <laughs> my friends in, my friends in, uh, um, just take this vocal down a little wee bit in this moment. Did you just move it a little bit? Thank you. Okay, this must be me. Um, my friends in Victoria, they've all had to quit smoking dope now. You know, there's all the hippies in Victoria there. They've all moved. They're nasty people. They moved from Central Canada, left their families so they could get some sunshine. They moved to the West Coast and just left their families behind. They've smoked dope for 40 years. Ago. Now they've had to quit because they've got hernias in their navels. And they've had to get them operated off of sucking joints. You get this hernia. <laughs> Again, this is socialized medicine. This hasn't come down here yet. A naval hernia. Sounds like one of the Bush wars, doesn't it? Operation Naval Hernia. And they, so they have to quit smoking dope. You know, they've been chilled out for 40 years. They've been like, oh yeah, man. <laughs> now they're like, give me those fucking chips. <laughs> You've had to quit smoking dope. They're mean, nasty. We call them meaners, mean seniors. <laughs> Don't go there. Don't take the ferry. First of all, it's a nasty ferry. And second of all, they're mean seniors in Victoria. Have you been there? Yeah. Have you noticed? Yes. Yeah, not so nice, are they? Yeah, I have some affirmations like a Pentecostal church. <laughs> Hallelujah! Hallelujah! See, I've, I've taught you something. Don't go to Victoria. Poke you with their umbrella in the shop with Drug Mart when you're trying to get the Kyopecti. <laughs> Motorcycles, Saturday night.